The new patriotic party in the Ashanti region has set for itself a target to win all 47 parliamentary seats in the Ashanti region in the December polls. The Aswase, Ejura Sechidumase, and Setre Afram Plains constituencies are currently being held by NDC members of parliament. The MPP says its target in the December polls is to win these three constituencies to achieve achieve what it christened the 4747 agenda, addressing a packed auditorium at a ceremony to outdoor the parliamentary candidates in Kumase, national chairman for the MPP, Fedi Blay, called on party members to work hard. I'm not aiming at 2020. We are aiming at 2020, 2024, 2028. 2032. The power has come and we must aim at ensuring that it doesn't go away at all. And it is you who are about to be introduced today who are going to work for it. I will say that most of you to guarantee that you will go to parliament. About 90-95% now we are aiming 100% that you go to parliament. Now, don't be complacent. Don't take things for granted. The MPP's target is coming at a time when some aggrieved party members have decided to contest as independent parliamentary candidates in some of the party's strongholds. Some party leaders say a lot is being done to get those independent parliamentary candidates to rescind their decision to run against the party. Actually, that's why I've been appointed the patron of the organizing committee. I'm going to go around trying to persuade them to come back to the fold and allow our elected candidates to go forward. We are going to work very hard. Because of that, I'll move for Accra and come and stay in Kumasi for the next two months. We continue to talk to them. We are seriously engaged. Some have stepped down. We're also still talking to some. And I'm confident that uh, the NPP at the end of the day uh, will make headway in where we have these small, small disputes. Also, we have a national uh, committee in charge of uh, reconciliation where we are also tasking them to also up their game so we get to the bottom of it. Some parliamentary candidates spoke to City News. It is therefore in Sertia that such sweet togetherness as this prevail to outdoor us and also to let our constituents get focused on the candidates because there is a sort of wide skill orchestration sort of having independent candidates everywhere and these functions are important for our constituents to see the official representation because some of them sometimes even campaign to the extent that the party supports them. Complacency is a killer. I don't think that any of the PCs in, in this region is complacent. None of us is complacent. We are working assiduously. As I tell you, as I told you earlier on, every weekend we embark on cleanup exercises. We do house to house campaign, door to door campaign. We are not complacent because we know and we believe that complacency kills. For most party supporters, they are hopeful the MPP can achieve the set target. 47 47 is possible. Looking at the hard work Nanado and his team has done, you know, everything boils down to how the government organized himself and do developmental works. A 47 47 agenda for MPP in Ashanti region is really possible because when you look at the good works of Nanado down Kwakofado, how it's going national and especially in Ashanti region, how everything is chairs, planting for food and jobs, and many more. The event was also to officially launch the Ashanti regional campaign ahead of the December polls. MPP party supporters in the Ashanti region have expressed their readiness to work closely with the party to ensure the 4747 agenda is achieved. From Kumase in the Ashanti region, Hafiz Tijani for City News.